Welcome to Tennis Lab. In today's video, we'll be exploring the fascinating world of tennis court surfaces. Have you ever wondered what sets clay, grass, and hard courts apart? Join us as we dive into the key differences and discover how they affect the game. Let's get started. Before we jump into the details, let's briefly introduce the three main types of tennis court surfaces, clay, grass, and hard courts. Each surface presents its unique characteristics and challenges for players. So, what makes them distinct? Let's find out. Clay courts are known for their slow pace and high bounce. The surface is made up of crushed brick, shale, or stone, which provides a softer and more forgiving landing for the ball. The loose composition of clay allows players to slide, making it an advantage for those with excellent footwork and defensive skills. However, the slower pace can test a player's patience and require more physical endurance. Grass courts offer a completely different experience. They are the fastest playing surface in tennis. The grass is meticulously maintained, offering a low and skiddy bounce. This demands quick reflexes and precise footwork. As the ball tends to stay low and often skids through the surface, grass courts require players to adapt their game, favoring aggressive serve and volley players like Pete Sampras. Lastly, we have hard courts, the most common surface found worldwide. Hard courts are made of asphalt or concrete, with a top layer of acrylic or synthetic material. The ball bounces consistently allowing players to rely on a balanced style of play. Hard courts are considered medium-paced surfaces, providing a good compromise between the speed of grass and the slowness of clay. It's worth noting that hard courts can vary in speed, depending on the specific material used. Now that we understand the basic differences between clay, grass, and hard court surfaces, let's explore how these variations impact the game and player strategies. On clay courts, players have more time to set up their shots due to the slower ball speed. The high bounce also gives players more options for topspin shots, allowing them to impart greater control over the ball's trajectory. The sliding ability on clay permits players to reach wider shots and execute defensive maneuvers effectively. Grass courts, with their low bounce and faster pace, favor players with powerful serves and aggressive playing styles. The ball tends to stay low making it challenging to execute topspin shots effectively. Serve and volley players often excel on grass, using their speed and net skills to take advantage of the quick conditions. Hard courts offer a balanced playing field that suits a variety of playing styles. The consistent bounce allows players to develop a more aggressive baseline game, with both power and spin. Hard courts showcase the true versatility of players as they can adapt their strategies to the specific speed and conditions of the court. So, next time you are watching a tennis match, pay attention to the court's surface and how it influences the game. It's truly remarkable how the surface impacts player strategies and the overall dynamics of the match. That's it for today's video on the key differences between clay, grass, and hard court surfaces. We hope you found this exploration informative and insightful. If you